got to hit them. So how do we build these smart cities and what do we need people to do by 2030? Now, they have some pretty aggressive goals and some of them are up there. And they look, I mean, if you're watching Blaze TV, you'll you'll see them up from the website itself. Um, but let me let me give it to you just in case you're not watching, because gosh darn it, these um, these stats are a little sticky. So food, food, uh, they need to reduce the emissions of food uh, by 2030. So the their their target, their target by 2030 is uh, you will only have 16 kilograms of meat. Per year. Now, their aggressive target for 2030 is that you have zero kilograms of meat. I'm telling you what they're doing to the farmers and the ranchers, what these giant, the four big food processors are doing. They're driving them out of business so you can't have any local ranchers growing meat because they're getting rid of meat. Listen to Klaus Schwab, who says by 2030, meat will be for the rich and very wealthy for special occasions only. You with that? Again, on their own website, 16 kilograms, that's all you can have of meat. Right now, uh, the dairy consumption, milk or derivative equivalent, so cheeses and everything else, they're hoping that you will only have 90 kilograms of that, but their aggressive, ambitious target for 2030 is zero. Now, remember, they need you to live like we lived in the pandemic, except without the nice stuff that you might have had, like cheese and milk and meat in the pandemic. Uh, you'll be required to only have 2,500 calories a day. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't think I can live on 2,500 calories a day.